Okay, so we're here in the beautiful gardens at Nanonagel Place and just behind me here is the Goldie Chapel and in a couple of weeks time we're going to be presenting Path Through the Dark, the story of Nanonagel and it's a theatre production and it's funded by the Arts and Community Award and it's uh, funded by the Arts Council and managed by CREATE and also part funded by the Presentation Sisters of South West Province and Path Through the Dark is the story of Nano Nagel but told in a very intriguing sort of very evocative way I would say. And what we did was we wanted to look at her broader life before um, she set up the convent and before she set up the schools to kind of look at what inspires a woman to act like that, to take, to have the courage that she did at the time because she had a huge amount of courage to do what she did um, and also to just kind of give you a little hint into the fact that it's not huge moments that create shifts in society or history, but it's tiny moments, very small and significant ones. And we wanted to pull together a collection of those, of her time um, in Ballygriffin when she was a child, in Paris when she was having her education, and when she came back to Ireland, and then how that all influenced to have the knock-on effect of her setting up the schools here at that time. There's the artistic director of Ocean of Notions Theatre Company, Judy Chalmers, so she's directing the piece. She's also acting at the part of Nano Nagel. Uh, I'm the producer and co-writer with Judy. Then we have Annette Buckley also, who's a uh, an amazing singer, songwriter, well known here in Cork. We have a fabulous sound designer, composer, Shane O'Sullivan on board as well, who's worked with us on previous projects. And then we have Simon McHale, who's well known here in Cork as well in the early music uh, festival and other projects. He's actually arranged the, the music then as well. You can't engage with her life story for any even short period of time without it having a huge shift on your own self as a woman, especially a woman today. It is a very inspiring tale, so I love to say to invite everybody to it really not just those who maybe have an interest in Nano Nagel herself or the history of Cork but also for any of us in this very fast-paced life because I think her story in a strange way has never been more relevant and it's going to start on the 23rd of April so very soon uh, Tuesday the 23rd running till Saturday the 27th and there's a few matinee shows and also a few evening shows and it's all online the information at Nanonagel Place on their website and also tickets on Eventbrite.